Hello beautiful people, welcome back to my channel. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. Go do it now, yes. Okay, what I want to talk to you about today was a few ways to incorporate into your diet healthy bacteria and also supplement in vitamin D and why you should do this. Okay, so if you know me personally, you know I'm very competitive. And last week I completely pushed myself way too far, I believe. So I've been taking cycle bar classes and when I get in there, I tell myself I'm going to just do this to get a good sweat, but it ends up becoming like I have to get first place or I have to get third place or above. So I went twice in a row last week. After going to the gym and doing legs, my legs were still completely cached. Like they were sore to the touch. And I pushed myself way too hard. And this week, I definitely felt it. My immune system was slow, my stomach was upset, and I just completely crashed and burned my body. So, this week I took a step back, didn't go to the gym, I did take one cycle class, I didn't go balls to the wall like normal, I just kind of rode for the fun of it and did get sweat. So, and on top of that, I, I don't always track my food I kind of just intuitively eat unless I'm just curious what I'm eating that week or that day or whatever. And I'm pretty sure since I was going so intensely last week, I was in a caloric deficit, which also I think contributed to my being under the weather this week because I wasn't properly fueled for my intense cardio and then workouts. So, first, let's see. We're gonna talk about this vitamin D with the 5,000 I use. This is just the Puritans Pride brand. It's little online supplements. You can get any vitamin D, it doesn't really matter. But the importance of vitamin D, first of all, it can boost your mood, it improves your sleep, gives you strong bones and teeth. Um, it helps with the absorption of calcium, and most importantly, it helps maintain a healthy immune system. So whenever I'm feeling sick, I will take one of these in the morning, like usual with my breakfast, and then around lunch or dinner, I will take a second one to give my immune system a little boost. So this is one of my staples in supplements, so I definitely would take this daily. You don't have to get the 5,000 I use, but I would definitely get some sort of supplemented in vitamin D. Second thing I want to talk about is Faye, 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 yogurt. This yogurt I mean, I personally, I like Greek yogurt. Some people don't like the bitterness of it or the non-sweetness of it, but I can eat Greek yogurt plain. And Greek yogurt is a good way, I don't know why I have this pen. It's a good way to get in the healthy bacteria that your gut needs. Because if your gut's happy and healthy, your body is gonna be happy and healthy. So, definitely recommend this. By 0%, 0% will give you like no fat. See, it's no fat, zero, zero. Yeah, it's pretty, it's pretty good. It is a little bit pricey, but I definitely think it's worth it. So I definitely incorporated this in this week. And today is Friday. I was feeling really terrible Monday and Tuesday, and I feel a lot better today. So that's my little tidbit sharing with you all today. And also to conclude this video, do not push yourself too hard. Yes, work hard, but not do not 
overdo yourself to where like you're just sore all the time you need to give your body time to recover or it will you know lose some of its I guess integrity to stay healthy you need to give your body a rest and just you know come to one with yourself and really know your body and when you need to realize that you need to stop and take a break that's one thing I've been working on because like I said I am very competitive and I just push and push and push so remember like I just said I'm probably repeating myself like a million times but know your body and know when you need to stop and have a rest have a wonderful day hope you enjoyed don't forget to like Give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. Catch you in the next one.